Let me tell you what it looks like when I try to design a new piece. I was asked to make some earrings that were similar to this design that I've previously done. The request was for statement earrings with clean lines. So I kind of took that and started to sketch and think about some things that I could do. And I finally came up with this design and thought that looks really nice. So then I made my first prototype out of copper. This one you can see that I've got the top pretty well finalized. I like how that looks. And then I started trying to stabilize the bottom. I wanted to get a stone in here too. Um, opal was requested and opal is such a beautiful stone. So I wanted to do the opal at the bottom. So I tried a setting idea, like maybe this could go like that. But I did a test and I didn't like how it looked. And I didn't love that I needed wires on the sides to stabilize. So next I tried a version like this and you can see that I'm trying something new with the bottom here. This is round 26 gauge wrapping wire. And I thought, okay, I like that a little bit better, but how can I make these lines cleaner? So then I came up with the design for the bottom that I went with, and I think that looks really nice. But then I had to figure out a different setting for the stone, so I did something like this. And now you can see that something's really starting to come together. Now that I've got a solid idea of what I'm doing uh, by my third copper prototype, you can see that as I go, I do a lot of math and taking notes about measurements because if I can't recreate it, then it won't turn into a design. So then I start writing down the steps as I make the final prototype and I write down exactly what I did and in what order because a lot of times the order of the steps really matters. And this is the final copper prototype of this new earring design in copper with champagne cubic zirconia set in sterling silver at the bottom. Now I'm ready to make these in silver. Check out my website to get yours.